Moving along, um, you know, Keikala is a star both on and off the field. Check this out. Recently, he was named one of 10 finalists for the Campbell Trophy, which uh, means that he earns an $18,000 post-grab scholarship. An incredible accomplishment, no doubt. On the field, Keikala has 18 tackles so far this season, while he's also leading the team with four pass breakups. Last year, he was a first-team All-Mountain West performer, and it appears he's picking up right where he left off, both on the field and in the classroom, where he carries a 3.94 GPA. Okay, Cal, I wanted to get back to your academics for a second real quick. When your football playing days are done, what would you like to do eventually? Hopefully open up, you know, maybe some of my own doctor's offices or things like that and get on the more administrative side of things. Get into a career that bridges the gap between, you know, medical sciences and business too. So something within like healthcare administration is what I'm looking forward to getting into. I really do love, you know, the medical sciences and that field of things, but at the same time, you know, I've really been liking these business classes, so I'm hoping to do something where I can put both of them together and, you know, have a lot of fun doing it. So that's the plan. When it comes to all your academic success, who would you credit as like an influence or maybe even motivation or your, your biggest helper in, in achieving all this success? Definitely, you know, my parents who kind of instilled that in us from, a, from an early age, the importance of that. But I just go back to all of my teachers throughout you know, my whole education from kindergarten to now, because I can't remember a time where I've ever had a bad teacher. You know, all of my teachers have really been great mentors and influences for me. And a lot of them um, from high school, I still reach out to me. They shoot me texts, you know, I'll call them or I'll see them when I go home. Put you on the spot here. Favorite teacher and why? Ray Parker, because he was also not only my teacher, he was also our basketball coach. And when he taught social studies, um, it was something that you wanted to be a part of and never leave that classroom. And he'd also come out and play uh, basketball and stuff with us at recess and at lunch. So it was always fun to get taught by our teacher and then get to go hoop up with him after. He shoots me texts and DMs all the time. So 